All right, so here's an overall, you know, view at an RNC cabinet. You've got the different components here. You know, you've got the high voltage area here, and you've got the controls section here. And then on the RNC series, the burners are down here, or the, or the heat, I should say, the heat source. So if you had electric heat, you'd be down here. What you're seeing here is gas. So from a controller standpoint, you know, this is a pretty typical control strategy for a makeup air unit. So you see on the top left here is what we call the VCC X2 controller. That's basically the brains of the unit, okay? Everything, all the sequences, all the set points, the time of day scheduling, everything lies in there. It's a what, what's called a configurable controller. So you go in and you change all the configurations that you need to add the set points. And it basically tells most of the components what to do and takes in all the inputs, et cetera. Most of the inputs anyway. So the next controller here we could talk about is MHGRVX controller. That is the modulating hot gas, hot gas reheat valve controller. And that's responsible to, as it sounds, control the reheat in the unit. So there's a three-way modulating reheat valve, you know, controlling the reheat valve typically on some sort of temperature, either supply air temperature or space temperature reset, something along those lines. So in the dehumidification mode, we're basically producing a very cold coil and we're reheating the air to a specific temperature. Let's say we wanted to reheat it to 65 degrees, then we would modulate the valve, the reheat valve, to achieve the 65 degrees. And that's basically the function of the modulating hot gas reheat valve controller. Then you have, I'll stick with the refrigeration. So this is the RSM digital, RSMD, which is the refrigeration controller for the digital compressor. Okay, so this is responsible for looking at the suction pressure in the suction line with a suction pressure transducer it converts that into a temperature and we're telling it, you know, make the temperature be whatever. So let's say 42 degrees, which would probably be like a 48 to 50 leaving air off the coil. And it's modulating the compressor to achieve that specific suction, saturated suction temperature. And you could actually probably hear that in the background here. So the mod gas controller, this is responsible for modulating the gas heat. And basically what it does is we give it an input when it's in the heating mode, we give it an input of a temperature, achieve this at this specific temperature sensor. It could be in the supply duct or in this, and it modulates the gas heat to achieve that temperature. So that's basically the rundown of the controllers in an Aon unit.